Hello, Taurus. How are you guys doing? Welcome to Free Bag. Welcome to your January 2022 prediction, okay? Take what resonates, leave the rest. This is a general reading, but keep in mind that if you feel like it doesn't resonate, this is something that is uh, predicted for the month of January, so it may not have happened yet, okay? All right, Taurus, so let's get straight into it. Please do not forget to hit the like button for me, please. I really appreciate it. It does help to get the uh, video out there on YouTube, okay? As always said, do check your moon, rising, and Venus signs, all right, for more information. All right, this is for my blog guy. What the freak is coming towards Taurus? Let's brace ourselves. <laughs> brace yourselves, Taurus. All right. I cut myself really bad, so that's what's going on with my ridiculous bandage. All right, so we're going to start by doing an overall love for January 2022. And then we're going to specifically talk about new love. So if you want to know about new love, just skip this part, okay? Um, we will talk about your work, your career, finances, and also give you guys some guidance towards the end, okay? This is the first prediction that I'm doing for Taurus. So welcome, guys. Thank you guys so much for the views. I really appreciate it. Now, if only I can get this camera to stop, like, Harlem shaking. <laughs> All right. Okay. What is coming towards Taurus and love in January 2022? January 2022 for Taurus in love. January 2022 for the Taurus in love. January 2022 for the Taurus in love. Taurus, you got trust. Have faith that the right person is being brought to you at the perfect time. When trust comes out, it's usually a matter of trust, okay? Trusting yourself, trusting the divine, trusting this person. Okay, bottom of the deck, you got retreat. Take some time away from the situation to have some perspective on it. So that may be what you're doing right now. Or the person, okay, maybe someone has some trust issues here. I can't even blame them. I can't even blame the motherfuckers. I have trust issues, all right. This is for Taurus. Let's see what's going on here. January 2022 for the Taurus. January 2022 in love for Taurus. January 2022 in love for Taurus, please. January 2022 in love for Taurus. What is coming? January 2022 in love for Taurus. January 2022 in love for Taurus. You may be dealing with a fire sign, Taurus. Okay. Okay, so why do I feel like, yeah, this may be definitely someone that you've given up on, Taurus. I'm kind of feeling like this is someone that you are with, an ex, okay? Somebody's coming on in, strong Virgo here, okay? We have the Hermit, and then we also have uh, Gemini and Virgo in the Magician. So this person's coming in here, Taurus. <laughs> um, they're going to they're gonna, they're gonna give it all they've got, okay? They're going to give it all they've got to try to get you back in their life, to try to get back together. But I just feel like this is someone that you don't really trust, Taurus. Okay, for some of you, maybe you're trying to get this person back, okay? You're doing what you what you can. I mean, they're, they're just throwing everything that they've got at you, Taurus. I don't, sometimes I really don't care for the magician because it does kind of, it is someone who's kind of pulling strings, doing and saying certain things to get their desired results. So it can be seen as manipulation, just a little bit here, okay? Don't let the freak manipulate you, Taurus, okay? <laughs> but they're gonna, you know, they're gonna ask to see you, page of wands, you know, that's what they want, okay? Um, but I feel like this is still a page. This is someone who's still immature, young, okay? Could be another Taurus, possibly. But I feel like for the most part, you're very focused on your money. You're focused on yourself here, okay? Some of you are leaving behind another earth sign, okay? There's a separation here. And possibly you're headed towards a um, an empress, maybe someone who has children. But that's what they're going to do, Taurus. Somebody's definitely going to try their best, put on their best show, okay, to try to get you back. That's what they're going to do here. They're going to give it their best you know swing their fight and if they come towards you Taurus, more than likely you may just fucking curse them out okay and get into a real argument with this person because you really may be pissed off with this person and you want nothing to do with them 
okay but this person's coming in with judgment what is the five of wands for taurus i'm also hearing gemini okay scorpio as well what is the five of wands for taurus january 2022 in love five of wands what is this five of wands please yeah you <laughs> This is someone that you're good on, completely good. They're going to keep trying it, Taurus. I'm telling you. You got the Six of Coins, Reverse, the Ace of Swords. Not, they're going to keep trying it. They really want to get you back, okay? For some of you, I just feel like this person could just be jealous. They don't want to see you move on. Okay, so it's probably like a, a tactic to kind of see if they could win you over again, see if they can get you back. See if they still have power over you. I don't know. That's what I'm picking up, Taurus. Someone who just thinks that they got it like that. They can just come in and work their magic and boom, Taurus is back in my arms. Taurus is back in my life. But they're in for a rude awakening here, okay? What is this magician going to try to do to my Taurus? Let's see what this freak, this lunatic. What is a magician? What is a magician? The Ace of Coins. Some of them they may they may offer you money. Okay. Hey Taurus, you know here you know I got some money for you or whatever something that you like. They may try to get it for you a gift. They're gonna try. Well, they can. The Knight of Swords is not one to back down in any kind of competition. The Five of Swords reverse. They're trying to get you back. They're in a very and they're in a rush to get you back, Taurus. All right. What is the Page of Wands? But if you give this person another chance, Taurus, I hate to say it, but this is someone who's just going to, they're going to disappoint you again. They're going to hurt you again. Page of Wands. I think they already hurt you. They just want to see if they still have power over you. The Emperor is in the reverse. Maybe dealing with some power-hungry Aries, okay? Somebody who wants to have their cake and to eat it too. You're going to be in the same cycle with this person. What is this Hermit Reverse for Taurus? January 2022, Hermit Reverse. Ooh, yeah, this, this this Virgo, whoever this person is, is not, they're not moving on. They're not forgetting you. They're still holding on to you here. Okay. Some of you, maybe you're still holding on to this ex. Okay. And Spirit is telling you, you need to release this person. It's time. They're full of crap. Okay. What is Judgment. This page is not bringing anything new. They're not saying anything different. So it's definitely time to let go of this, this person. It's time. It's time to trust that you're making the right decision. A lot of you, you feel like the, the surest thing right now is just to focus on yourself, your money, okay? And that is the best thing that you can do right now. And whoever this person is, they're going to have to kick rocks because... I, I don't see you giving them anything. You're not investing in this person. You're not You're not giving them another chance. So they're out of luck. <laughs> but they're going to try. They're going to try. This person may even be someone who has been ghosting you. They're going to try. They're going to try it. But I don't think you're falling for it. You're not falling for it, okay? All right, so let's talk about specifically new love in January 2022 for the Taurus. New love, January 2022 for Taurus. New love, new love for Taurus in January 2022. New love for Taurus, January 2022. New love ex expectations. Unrealistic expectations are keeping you from meeting your life partner. And this could mean anything. You know what you're doing, Taurus. <laughs> wow, look what we got. New love. There is someone on the horizon who's coming into your life. Some of you, this new love may be someone you already know, okay? Doesn't have to be an ex, but just someone that you already know. Okay. All right. New love for Taurus in January 2022. New love for Taurus in January 2022. New love for Taurus in January 2022. New love for Taurus in January of 2022. Okay. New love for Taurus in January 2022. 
new love for Taurus in January 2022. New love for Taurus in January 2022. New love for Taurus. Ace of Swords, Ten of Coins, and the Lovers. And, oh, whoop the, and the Three of Coins, and the Empress is at the bottom of the deck. Well, a lot of cards are falling out here, Taurus. Um, so strongly, you maybe your new love may very well be an Aquarius, a Libra, or a Gemini in 2022, January, okay? Um, or a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, yes. You have the Empress here. You may be dealing with someone who has children, okay? But I feel like um, whoever this person is, they're 100% sure what they want from you here. Okay, they're clear, they're, deci they're decisive. This is someone who has um, values, morals. This is not a cheater, a liar. This is someone who's very honest. They're very witty, very funny. Okay, um, and they are very interested in you. It does seem like there's a very strong mental and physical connection here between you and this person. They want to build with you. They do want the 10 of coins with you, Taurus. They do. Um, some of you, I hate to say it, you may be dealing with someone who's, married but they're in love with you okay if that's the case i do see with the king of swords they are working to get a divorce and it is serious that they will get a divorce i'm not just saying that okay so yeah you may find that you have a decision to make here some of you are very focused on your work your business right now you may meet this person through work through business maybe this could be a business partner is what i'm hearing or school but i mean taurus this is someone who's serious a very serious lover um, they, they, they're here. They're not playing any games with you. They know what they want. They're going to treat you right. Empress is here. Okay. Um, they want growth here with you, Taurus. But like I said, somebody right now just may be in this energy of trying to work on themselves, their finances. Okay. But they, I mean, this person is very interested, Taurus. The King of Swords can tend to have very um, strong, like, opinions, beliefs, expectations. So some of you may just need to take it down just a little bit here. Be a little bit more realistic here, okay? Maybe give this person a fair chance, all right? <laughs> what is this King of Swords for Taurus, New Love, January 2022? What is this King of Swords? But, I mean, there's a strong presence of air here, okay? Yeah, some of you, this person's getting a divorce. You're getting a divorce, but this new love, this person, could definitely be a twin flame connection. Who is this King of Swords for Taurus? January 2022. Who is this King of Swords for Taurus? In January of 2022. Who is this King of Swords? The Wheel of Fortune. This could be, you know, someone that you're meant to be with here. Destiny. You may just meet this person. Just, I mean, it's almost like... It's meant for you. It's either meant for you to be with this person or you're going to meet this person in the craziest way, the craziest way. OK, six of wands is here. This is definitely someone, you know, you, you probably got your eye on here, Taurus. OK, they've got their eye on you. Ace of Swords for Taurus, new love, um, January. The seven of wands. The Eight of Swords reverse. Tell me more about this Ace of Swords. The Two of Coins. So it may very well be known that somebody here is juggling. Maybe someone, like I said, it doesn't have to be another person, but it could be a third factor here. Work, school, mental health, emotional health, family. There could be cultural differences here, distance. It could be anything. What is the Ten of Coins? But, I mean, one thing for sure is that they, this person, Eight of Coins, this person truly desires a family with you. They truly desire long-term with you, Taurus. This is, this is what they want. This is what they want. What is this Three of Coins? The Queen of Wands, the Page of Wands, the Devil Reverse. What is the Lovers? What is the lovers? Strength card could be with a Leo. Ooh. The 
four of wands and the star. Yeah, so I have a reason to believe some of you, not all of you, you're dealing with someone who may be married or um, they live with this person, but obviously the love is reversed. The love is not there. Someone's working to detach from a karmic partner. So that may be something to consider, but I mean, it, it's showing that it's love. <laughs> it's showing that you guys are meant to be together. Eventually, this is going to come together. That's what it's showing, Taurus. Okay. All right. That's what we got for new love in January of 2022 for the Taurus. So now let's take a look at work, finances, career. Work and career for Taurus in January of 2022. Working career for Taurus in January 2022. Okay. All right. So you got abundance. Abundance came out here. You got ask your angels. Some of you are, are like asking like, okay, am I in the right position? You know, is this the right job for me? Should I take this other offer? Should I... Some of you, you need to hear that there is something better if that is the case for you. Working career for Taurus in January 2022. Working career for Taurus in January of 2022, please. Ooh. Okay. So you got Knight of Coins, which is, you know, this is you. <laughs> Working career for Jan for Taurus in January 2022. Working career for Taurus in January of 2022, please. Working career. Working career for Taurus in January of 2022. Okay. And the Six of Wands. So it looks like um, if some of you, if you're looking for some kind of um, opportunity, it is coming. Okay. It is coming. Nine of coins, but for others of you, whatever this is that you're doing, it is going to bring abundance into your life. Some of you are thinking about business ideas, okay? Some of you are business owners, whatever it is, I feel like Spirit is kind of giving you more of advice here. Um, it's telling you, you know, to continue to move slowly but surely here. Um, as long as you have a plan, you have the vision for it, okay? Okay. You have the willpower here. You have the commitment, the dedication. You will get to where you want to go in this, in your current situation or with your, your business, okay? I feel like you tend to be a little critical of yourself at times with a judgment card. You judge yourself very harshly, Taurus, okay? But you can get through this. Your resilient strength. Is about, you know, knowing the inner power that you possess, knowing the inner courage that you possess, okay? So as long as you're confident in yourself and you stay committed, all right, success is yours. Success is yours. You will be successful. You will come out as the victor, okay? Um, if you're worried about your money, you will be financially stable. That will be coming, okay? Yeah, nothing to worry about. See, right behind Nine of Coins, you're worrying. Some of you are conflicted between um, a decision when it comes to your work, your career, okay? But I feel like whatever decision you're thinking about making, you definitely go for it because it will make you abundant, okay? So that's what we have for the Taurus, January 2022, work and career, okay? So now I'm just going to go ahead and pull some guidance. Ugh. Guidance for Taurus in January. Guidance for Taurus in January 2022. Guidance, please. Guidance for Taurus in January of 2022. Guidance. All right. So, Taurus, you got grounded. Many of the most evolved beings on earth are regular folks living with joy, dignity, and courage. Yeah, that's that courage again. You got flow. Allow me, divine, to move with the flow and respond with calmness and peace. Just go with the flow of things, okay? Stop judging yourself so damn harshly. <laughs> Expansiveness. Eternity is far more creative than the rigid, constrained, and exhausted ego. So that is what they want to tell you, Taurus. You also have invite help. Invite the divine to pursue you. Seriously, just say I'm finally ready. Pursue me. Interesting. 
All right. So I hope you enjoyed your January 2022 prediction. Thank you guys for tuning in. Love you all. See you guys next time.